Hello there, and welcome to this uh, movie review today of Dead Man Down. So, just got out of the theater here, and before I get to the movie, I thought it was just an observation that as I was getting out, uh, a mom and her daughter were running from theater to theater to see what was good that was playing, and thought it was a pretty bad set of morals to to give to your daughter at the age of seven or whatever how old she was of oh it's alright to hop from theater to theater without paying money and <laughs> um, just a weird thing I noticed so anyways let's get into the movie Dead Man Down so this movie I wanted to see especially because it had Naomi uh, no, uh, Rapice I'm not sure how to say her name exactly but she was um, the, the real star of Prometheus and she was the female lead in Prometheus and uh, she's done a couple of other films. Uh, she was in the Girl with the Dragon Tattoo, the original, and then its sequel. And I was curious to see her in this new film, another American film, um, and see what she would be like in this. Um, and she was great. She was great. Um, very complex character. Um, she had a serious car accident because of a drunk driver hitting her and had reconstructive surgery on her face and her story was dealing with that and all the side effects that go along with it including kids bullying her, throwing stuff at her, calling her monster and different things and very complex character I'd say and a character that was compelling to see that story of and a character that wanted revenge um, wanted to see person that did that to her harmed and the other character a victor as we're known by that name uh, initially is a different character who has another complex background and care uh, complex background and history to him he had a wife and kid and they were taken from him um, in a sense so um, his is another story of revenge, and this is definitely a revenge movie. That is at the heart of this, but it's a complex revenge movie. It's a movie that has a lot of depth to it, a lot of intrigue to it. The music was well done, and it felt very mysterious at times. Uh, some of the tonal things that sound a bit like Prometheus, which I found was a bit odd. Um, but this was a movie I really did enjoy. It was a movie that was more complex and deep than your traditional revenge movie of uh, just the dead simple revenge movies that are out there. This is a more complex film and a film that I think will take multiple viewings to get its full grasp in. But on first viewing, very well done, very entertaining. It, it was a film that took its time to get where it was going. It was a film that was able to have silence and be okay with that. And so for people that like action all the time or uh, continual momentum, this had momentum, but it was a slower, slower churn. And I enjoyed it, but there were moments that pacing might not be perfect, but I think Instead of doing it like that, I'd say pacing was perfect, but it was a different kind of pace that perhaps the European audience might understand more than us Americans. So, um, Dead Man Down, in theaters now. I'd recommend seeing it at least once. I'm probably going to see a couple more times when it comes out on home video. So with that said, uh, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more movie reviews.